Hello everyone, welcome back to Ross's Creepy Reading. This is episode 31 of this year's of, a, of me reading creepy pastas. I've read 31 all together. Oh yeah, today. And after those three videos of me binge drinking, I got a massive killer hangover. So... Instead of going creepy, I'm going to go with a different variation of creepy and scaring the crap out of you. If you already know what this title is, thank you. I'm going to be reading The Tale of Shrek. This is... Give me a moment. I was nine... I was only nine years old. I love Shrek so much. I own all the movies and merchandise. What year is this taking place? Because... If I can get the year, I could say, so he watched all the Shrek movies, okay? I pray to Shrek every night, thanking him for the life I have been given. When did Shrek become God? Somebody answered me that one. When, then we started doing do it at Church of the Church of the Mighty Ogre, or the Mighty Onion. Whatever. Shrek is love, I said. Shrek is life. Okay, how is Shrek? I don't get this. My dad hears me and calls me a faggot. That is one homophobic father for saying that. And just because he said Shrek is love, Shrek is life, his dad calls him a faggot? I'm taking a guess his father was one of those jocks back in college who may have had a gay experience without trying. He was obviously jealous of my devotion to Shrek. No, you are crazy. Uh, you are crazy in the mind. Set to think of a computer ogre loves you, and you're devoted to this guy. I called him a cunt. Okay, why would you? That is the most stupidest thing to say to anyone. Call him that. You will get your head put on a pike. Okay, he slapped me and sent me to my room. <laughs> A father wouldn't just do a slap. He would have wailed on you for that insult. Based on how you're describing your father. I'll read the story again. Being more dramatic. At the... When I feel better. But it will be out tomorrow. Well, the 31st. Sorry. I am crying now. Because my face hurts. Your father just slapped you. Of course your face is going to bloody hurt. But he did hit you that... Did he do the open palm slap... Did that cause you to cry? Did he just bitch slap you, pimp slap you, kufa smacked you? What kind of slap did he do? I go into my bed, and it was very cold. Man, your father's also cheap, too. He can't even pay for the, the heating bill. I feel a warmth moving towards me. So he finally turned the heating on? That's a good... Th so he is nice in some ways. I felt something touch me. Is it you, Slender Man? I'm not in the mood. It's Shrek. Shrek, what are you doing out of the computer, of the DVD? And why DreamWorks coming in to capture your ass? I am so happy. I would be freaking out more if there was a tall green ogre just peering out of nowhere. He whispered into my ear, this is my swamp. I can get my room as I mean, the studio is a little dirty, but this is not a swamp. There's no there's no mud. There's no vegetation. There's not even a tree for you to, to live in. He grabbed me with his powerful ogre's hands and put me on his hands and knees. The hell? I'm ready. I need an adult. I spread my ass cheeks for Shrek. I need an adult! He penetrated my butt all over. Oh god! Oh god! I need an adult! I'm calling child services! I'm calling Chris Hansen! I'm calling anyone for this! It hurts so much, but I'll do it for Shrek. Oh god! I can feel my anus tearing. As my eyes started to water. Oh, God. 
I pushed against his force. Oh, Lord. Oh, I need... Oh, I want to please Shrek. I want to run away. <laughs> I, he roared a mighty roar as he filled my butt with his love. That ain't love, but that's something else. My dad walked in. And questioning, what the hell are you doing and why are you raping my child? I don't know if the child's a boy or a girl or not. Uh, you pedophilic ogre! Shrek looked him, I mean, looked him deep in the eyes and said, it's all ogre now. Oh, that's so bad. What's worse, that line or the child covered in splooge? Shrek leaves through my window. Shrek is love. Shrek is life. Oh my. This was inspired by more likely Fifty Shades of Grey. No wonder why it's on the troll pasta. Oh my lord, it's so. Ugh. It goes with the line of anal sex for a person. It goes with pedophilia. It hits the wrong notes. But I'm pretty sure that if I was. Uh, I'm pretty sure anyone else heard it. It doesn't feel right like this. We'll be feeling all grossed out a little bit. And why Shrek? Why did they pick it? Is this all the insults that we made about Japanese hentai where it's just some big creature f having sex with a young girl? I don't know why. But I'll do the scripting again with more of a dramatic styleness. So give me, Rasa will be given a moment. I was only nine years old. I loved Shrek so much. I owned all the movies and merchandise. I pray to Shrek every night, thanking him for the life I have been given. Shrek, Shrek are you pregnant? Shrek, I said, Shrek is life. My dad heard me and called me a faggot. He is obviously jealous of my devotion to Shrek. I called him a cunt. And he slapped me and sent me to my room. I am crying now because my face hurts. I go into my bed and it is very cold. I felt the warmth warming to towards me. I fell. Something touched me. It shrek. I am so happy. He whispered into my ear. This is my swamp. He grabbed me with his powerful ogre hands and put me on his hands and knees. I'm ready. I spread my ash cheeks for Shrek. <laughs> he penetrated my butthole. It hurt so much, but I'll do it for Shrek. <laughs> I could feel my anus tearing as my eyes start to water. I pushed against his force. I want to please Shrek. He roared a mighty roar as he filled my butt with his love. My dad walked in. Shrek looked him deep in the eyes and said, It's all over now. Shrek weaved through my window. Shrek is love. Shrek is life. Opinions? Don't turn it don't throw that camera. I've heard this one before. I was grossed out the first time. Now I am deeply scarred. That is the dramatic reading of this, what the hell, what they were thinking. I'm Shrek filled you with his ogre love. He, they're covered in splooge and this is pedophilia. I think I'm going to be sick. <laughs> I'll give this one a rating. Of nasty. <laughs> no, this is a rating of homemade. Only because of the fact... I think Dolman needs to take a shower. Never again. Never again. <laughs> never again. Well, this I is... will never be clean. <laughs> well, this has been the 30th one creepy reading. Creepy does not always mean scary, but it can also just creep you out. All I can say is, stay tuned for the next video for what we do next. Till then, Rasa signing out, and I take a bow.